second graders. Tonight we're going to be reading you The Crocodile and the Dentist. This is like a good story for us to have two parts in it. Lots of toothbrushes. I really don't want to. But I have to. I really don't want to, but I have to. Uh. Uh. Must I? Must I? <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. Hmm. I think they're both scared for different reasons. Mm hmm. But I should be brave. But I should be brave. He's a dentist, after all. He has to be brave. I'm ready for the worst. I'm ready for the worst. Ooh. Ow! Ouch! What an awful thing to do! What an awful thing to do! <laughs> There's no use getting angry. There's no use getting angry. Ooh, look at that too. Ooh, that looks rough. Yeah. You got it right in there. Gotta get that fixed. That happened to me a couple months ago. Oh. Not that bad. No, not that bad. <laughs> Just a little longer. Just a little longer. Hold in there. It looks like he's putting some stuff on this cavity. Hope it feel better. Seal it up. Phew. <sighs> Thank you so much. See you again next year. Thank you so much. See you again next year. Oof. Oh, exhausting for both of them. <laughs> I don't want to see him again. I don't want to see him again. <laughs> so I must remember to brush my teeth. So you must remember to brush your teeth, especially before you go to bed tonight. Oh yeah. So we have a special announcement. Tomorrow, which is Saturday, we're going to be doing a weekend bedtime story. So we're gonna do a special edition bedtime story tomorrow night dedicated to all the mothers of our second graders and grandmothers. So it's going to be a Mother's Day special bedtime story tomorrow night. So stay tuned for that. We hope you guys have an awesome Friday and have a great night and we'll see you tomorrow. Sleep time. Bye guys.